When it comes to the bold and the beautiful, every fan has their own opinion, and so Pup is no different. For five days, we sat and watched the good, the bad, and everything in between, and now we offer you a handy review, and a cheeky critique, of B&B's week that was, The Bold and the Beautiful, a critic's week in review having watched the 35th anniversary episode of The Bold and the Beautiful, I can say I was struck by five things. 1. My goodness. John McCook was a good-looking man. 2. This show really dropped the ball by not asking Ron Moss back. 3. I really, really miss Windsor Harmon. 4. Only in Brooke Logan Forrester's, Catherine Kelly Lang, sick little mind was she Thorne's true love, Macy who? Darla what? 5. Brooke really should have saved herself decades of drama and just stuck with lawman David Reed. Actually, there was a sixth thing, the entire premise on which this whole enterprise rested was absolutely ridiculous. Hope Logan Spencer, Annika Noel, announces to her mother that she's left her a meal warming in the oven, and Brooke decides that it's a good time to shut off all the lights and take a nap. Say what? Further B&B musings Does anyone else remember when The Bold and the Beautiful was a show about the inner workings of a fashion house? When models would strut down a catwalk or pose for the cover of Ion Fashion. When the foresters used to jostle for the CEO position. Or have to see off the rival Haute Couture House? If there's one thing that I know about Steffi Forrester Finnegan, Jacqueline McInnes would, it's that in any other circumstance, she would have charged into that alley, confronted Thomas Forrester, Matthew Atkinson, and Sheila Carter, Kimberlyn Brown, and demanded an explanation. But since TPTB is insisting on dragging this storyline out, she uncharacteristically slunk back into the Il Giardino kitchen, oversized purse in hand. New set alert. New set alert. Sure, it was a dumpster-filled alleyway, but it was so nice to see a new locale that wasn't Brooke's living room, one of the two offices at Forrester Creations, the Cliff House, or Carter Walton's, Lawrence Sunbeek door, pad. Why, pray tell, after all this time, is John Finn Finnegan, Tanner Novlin, checking up on Sheila. The Bold and the Beautiful, BB, airs weekdays on CBS. Check your local listings for airtimes. For more about what's coming up in Los Angeles, check out all the latest that's been posted on B&B Spoilers, and for an in-depth look at the show's history, click here. Adblock Test, why?